been a while guys it's been a while I've been stressing a bit shout out to the imposter down in China or down in Alberta here this one's for you I'll find you <laughs> this workout is fueled by that imposter so shout out to you I heard you've been studying in the University of Alberta maybe living in BC but either provinces BC Alberta it's a small world <laughs> so this man studies in law which I heard in the University of Alberta <sighs> he should know the law what How dare you imposter me? How dare you lie to the people of China? How dare you? Here's the thing I suggest you to do. Refund everybody you scam back. Refund everybody you scam back. This guy has his own Twitter of me and King Art. Pretending he's me. Let's keep this straight. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just gonna find your office, walk in, and ask you about <laughs> the laws of impersonating somebody or faulty impersonating somebody and selling faulty things online to China. How oh, dare you! Like I said, big boy, I'm not gonna hurt, harm you in any way. I'm gonna find your office, I'm gonna walk in and ask for some law advice about impersonating and fraud. I wanna see you eye to eye. I wanna see the posture corn. I wanna see how you look like. I wanna know if he gets his hair cut twice a week like me. <laughs> Or he has a dumb bad kitty like mine. Or he eats chicken rice and enjoys it like me. Nobody likes chicken ass more than me. I love chicken ass. And we're gonna finish this off with the close grip. Push-ups. That imposter corner is just nuts, guys. <laughs> Allure to be. That is crazy. Just like my farmer's dad. <laughs> Don't make fun of my farmer's dad, guys. It's nice. It's the new hip. Ah! Like I said, big boy, I'm not here to hurt you or harm you anyway. I just want to see the imposter face to face, eye to eye. Ask you about some advice. Let's eat. Human life is such a beautiful thing, don't you think? <laughs> Feels nice and tight, guys. Go and cup yourself one now. <laughs> Let's start this up, guys. Got a nice piece of chicken bouillon here, which I'm just gonna dump in into each one right here. Oh yeah, we're having hot pot. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna let that simmer away. Let's get into this guys, hot pot. If you guys don't know what hot pot is, I'll say it's like an Asian fondue, but better. <laughs> so we got fried tofu, we got beautiful Wagyu beef, we got shrimp, two pieces of cabbage, we got assorted fish balls, some spinach, a gnocchi mushroom, pork meatball, we got the iced tea and we got the Shanghai noodles there. Let's get into this. First things first, I'm gonna throw in our pork meatball because they're frozen and they take a while just to heat up. Next, our fish meatball. On the other side, two pieces of our cabbage. For dipping sauce, I got hoisin, got some sesame oil, and some sriracha. 
And I want to do some laogama chili paste or chili oil. My cabbage is done, so I don't want them to overcook, so I'm just going to take it out, throw it to the side. If I want to reheat it again, I'll just dunk it in. Throw in our enoki mushroom. In goes our tofu. I got a glass of ice. Got the good old Arizona iced tea or just tea. I'm gonna just drop the heat down a bit because it's hot enough. Guys, okay. Tofu. I gotta stand up because the camera's a little far. Yeah, it's got it. Quick tie. Nice. Mmm. That sauce is delicious. I'm gonna do the pork ball. Hopefully it's hot enough. Mmm. Enoki mushroom. If you guys never had enoki mushroom before, I'll say it's a must to have in a hot pot. Mmm. Gonna dip it in the tofu side. Turn that tofu. <clears throat> Hot. Dip a little sauce in there. Slurp on these noodles, guys. Quick time. Yes, got it. Nice. Wow. <laughs> I don't know what this is. Maybe egg? Take a bite of that. Mmm. I really don't know what that is. But I know it's deep fried and it's delicious. Guys, take the first sip of this. Ice cold Arizona. <laughs> mm. All right, I want some of this Wagyu beef. Less fatty than the other time. Let's see if this one melts in my mouth. I did see Shabu Shabu too, but I didn't get it. I wanted this. All right, guys. Wagyu beef. Take the first bite of this. You guys got it. Nice. It's good. But definitely still not melting your mouth. Huh. I'm kind of afraid of the hype maybe the overhype of wagyu beef maybe because my guess would be wagyu beef will be as tender as a prime rib cut here or is it more tender i don't know i think japan's the only place i would go for Wagyu beef or would buy from now just because that's the real stuff. <laughs> I 
I heard there's a farmer in America somewhere that is allowed to grow wagyu beef, I think. Or raise wagyu beef. Mm. This sauce, legit, can hype up anything. Check that out. Lago mouse sauce. Mm. So bomb. pink stuff. I'm not even sure because it just said assorted. Maybe fish wall. That is dyed pink. Yes, got it. Nice. Mmm. Just tastes like a fish ball. That is dyed pink. Mmm. <laughs> Arizona is so good with this. So light, sweet. Mmm. I'm really digging this fried tofu. What did I say this like before? A soup dumpling. It just soaks up all that goodness. Mm, 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 mm. Wow. Oh. 
today I have a hot, more fresher. I heard guys, this is cheese. Fish and cheese, deep fried. Take the first bite of this. Tell me if I'm wrong. Yeah, it's got it. Nice. That is weird. If you guys see that, it's slightly weird. There's some cheese in the middle there. Slightly weird, but very tasty at the same time. <laughs> so it's fish cake, cheese in the middle, that's deep fried. That's weird. But weirdly good. <laughs> I just turn off the fire. I wanna eat this beef. So I don't wanna over overdo it. Just lightly do it. That's bomb. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's so bomb. <laughs> More of this tofu here. Mm. Maybe a mung bean cake. I don't know. Let's go a few more shrimp. A little more noodles. Last bit of everything, guys. Got some noodles. Maybe one more piece of steak. Medium rare. You gotta have a medium rare. Maybe a bit of steak. spinach in there too. Slurp on this bite right here guys. Take the last bite of this. Yes, got it. Nice. Mm. That's what's up. So bombs. <laughs> so bombs, but so hot. Hot right here, hot outside, hot in the sunroom. But, mmm. Still all good. Mm. Some more of this beef here. It's 
something about this beef here. It's always playing mind tricks with me. I want to say it's good because it is good, but I'm expecting more from it for some reason because it is a Wagyu beef. Wagyu beef. <laughs> but I don't know. I enjoy it, but back of my head says it's not what I expect. That makes sense. Still buttery and tasty. Mm. Wow. Last bit here. I just want to finish off this beef. And that's it. Alright, got it nice and boiled. <laughs> Last bite of the day, guys. Mmm. It's buttery, goodness. But it doesn't melt. <laughs> Food and light is such a beautiful thing, don't you think? Hope you guys enjoy this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Also, don't forget to cop one your Food and Life's a Beautiful Thing shirt. Or take the first bite one. Or a nice one. Love this. Share this. Peace out.